I know it might sound hard to make farming and, and acreage life funner than it already is, but Tabos truly does that by freeing up a ton of time. It takes me half an hour to fill a hay boss feeder with six square bales, and they're good for a week. I have 16 horses, two cows, and 20 goats. Since I've had hay boss feeders, I find the animals are more content, not fighting so much, and uh, just more, more relaxed. Need is the mother of all inventions, right? Being kind of a half city and half farmer, uh, I could, one of the things that would really bug me is having to do chores every morning and every night. And my city friends, they were kind of free, you know, they had their freedom. And I'm not gonna get rid of my horses because I love my horses. I have horses all my life, right? All along, I kept telling myself, there's gotta be a better way. I just kept saying that, there's gotta be a better way. So I figured, well, I'm gonna try and use nets and come up with a feeder that I can put a bale of hay, a big round bale of hay out there, protect it from the weather. I told my dad, I said, hmm, this is something that's really interesting. I, I said, I would like to maybe be involved with this. Um, that's how it kind of started. And then we just slowly developed the feeder better and better to a full galvanized high-end piece of equipment because it is just that beneficial. Really went all out on designing the feeder along with my brother. He came in and he's a journeyman millwright. So at that time we kind of took it off my dad's hands and me and my brother decided to make a business out of Hay Boss Feeders and wanted to be able to offer everybody all the benefits that we had seen. This is our manufacturing shop here in uh, Edmonton, Alberta. We also have a manufacturing uh, plant in Wisconsin as well. Here we make the Junior Standard and Excels, all sizes. And uh, this here in front of us is our Junior. It holds uh, eight small square bales uh, made out of uh, galvanized metal. We wanted everything galvanized so that it would last the lifetime of a farmer. We run uh, 300 head of uh, meat goats. Before we had the hay boss feeders, we were feeding them just with the ordinary cattle feeders. And a bale on 30 animals would only last three, four days. With the hay boss feeder, it took us up all the way up to two weeks. There's hardly any wastage there. This feeder has been on this spot for two weeks. And if you'd had uh, another bale there in two weeks, you'd have used up five bales already, and 50% of that would have been on waste. You had to feed twice as much. Not, maybe not exactly twice as much, but pretty close. Now they, they got to work for it and they're not as picky because if they had a lot of feed, they would just pick out the best stuff and walk on the rest. Now they have to work for it, so they eat maybe 80, 90% of it. And it's way easier to work with this one because the bale lasts longer and if you just go and put the bale in and it's like for a week, there's really no work for feeding. We're Haystack Farm. We have 160 acres where we raise sheep and pastured pork and pastured chickens and pastured turkeys. With just even the time that we, we save and the extra hay we save, we're ahead of the game even by the end of this year with just purchasing this feeder. With the animals being able to get feed when they need it and all the time, you, don't, you have that peace of mind as well that goes with it. The hay is off the ground and it's also covered all the way around so no snow or rain can get in the top while they're eating it. And also for the wind because when it's really windy my hay was blown like everywhere so that made a big mess as well. And it's easy to load, that was one of my concerns. So was, you know, am I going to be able to do this myself? Sometimes I'm here by myself, sometimes not. But I have done it by myself the last few times and maybe it's taken me 15 minutes and it's in there longer so. Here at uh, Hay Boss Feeders, we are very excited for all the, the future farmers, whether it's high productivity down to a little acreage, just saving them time and all the health benefits. We are very excited to, to be able to offer this product to the people. Anybody that has animals, I think, <laughs> that eats hay, they would want this, this feeder. I don't think anybody should raise goats if they don't have the Hay Boss Feeder. Yeah, I'm gonna use Hay Boss Feeders until I quit. Ha <laughs> ha